Hey, welcome back to Impossible. Next up, I have Taurus. Where are my possible Taurus at? The time now is 3.53, which is 11. Okay, so again, the 11. That is your number. Again. Okay, so definitely, you know, spiritual realm. I send the masters, soulmates, twin flames. Pay attention to your dreams and downloads at this time. Some of you guys may have a headache, but just feeling. Mm. Let's just begin. Let's just begin. Yeah, 11. Some of you guys may be dealing with a Gemini. Gemini is all about communication. Some of you guys may have your rising moon of Venus or your north node in Gemini. Gemini is all about higher learning. Learning about yourself, learning about spirituality learning that what you're going through you know law of karma but black magic was thrown on some of you guys some of you guys may be in the porn industry some of you guys may be married and sleeping with the same sex on the side be careful with your kids and somebody accusing you of hurting your child and you get locked up or get locked up period health concerns health concerns somebody's sick here so definitely need to check your health. Yeah, 36 is nice. Things being illuminated to you. Protect your energy. Evil eye. Some of you guys may be dealing with a Leo or have rising water Venus, so you know if you're not a Leo. Hold on. Yeah, but more for gracefully. Some of you guys may be in the spotlight as well. Okay, but a lot of things being illuminated. And again, with your dreams. With your dreams. But trying to find happiness again. Trying to find peace again. Okay, it's like a Cinderella story. Some of you guys may love Cinderella. <laughs> okay, like came from a, I, I feel like, um, you know, when I think of Cinderella, like she was mistreated and there was like a turnaround in her life, right? So there's a turnaround coming in your life. You may not see it yet, but again, it says optimism. So be optimistic about your outcomes. Okay, but Leo is all about taking action some of you guys may be sensitive um to certain topics right some of you guys may have been mistreated as a child or suffer some type of childhood neglect here but um something about children okay yeah but here chio angel of lifestyle and affection generosity so there's so there's a generous offer coming in towards you guys somebody very generous joy finding joy again like i said pleasure doing what you love optimism remaining optimistic vitality leisure heart-centered fulfillment doing what you love following your heart right but i inspire your joy and i support time off in order to live a vibrant fulfilling and pleasant life it is okay to pamper yourself okay it is okay to pamper yourself but again spend wisely Okay, because some of you guys are having financial difficulties out there. But I do see things picking up in a turnaround in your life. Okay, so just continue to go, guys. Citrine, July. This, we in July. And take time away. So some of you guys are going on vacation and taking time off. But I see you guys have um, platinum blonde hair or blonde hair. But uh, 36 or 63. But again, protect your energy, guys. Okay, protect your energy. But I do see things picking up in your life. I do see love songs, so pay attention to music. So whatever song comes in your head, listen to the lyrics. Spirit is trying to send you a message. But really trying to feel good about oneself and deep contemplation at this time. Yeah. A lot of attention. <sighs> okay. This is tough, but so am I. Exactly. But again. Some, some type of problems within a household. Again, childhood healing. Things being overlooked 
in a house. Some trying to somebody's trying to sweet you. Somebody be careful with food and whatever people give you to eat at this time. Yes. But it's like living under a roof where you have because I feel a lot of researching going on here. A lot of researching, a lot of um somebody trying to find something out about you but again with the blindfolds here they can't find anything yes black and white elvis i believe elvis was a capricorn i believe he was some of you guys may be dealing with a capricorn or love love elvis music or yeah but black and white is all about balancing out your life some of you guys may be choreographer choreographers dancers in the spotlight already but it's like facing the truth within your own it's like you're you're just going within and trying to heal oneself at this time and trying to find joy again okay so this is tough but so am i and i do see things blooming okay some of you guys may plan be planning to travel to like rome or you know france overseas okay yeah some of you guys may be music artists out there actors or getting into that it's like coming to terms with your life okay and where you want to be and healing healing oneself from past past anger past resentment and regret you know you guys are tough Yeah, my condolences um, to anyone's loved ones who passed away. Yeah, my grandfather funeral is Friday. Had a lot of calls and texts coming in from family members all of a sudden. I was nice enough to call back. Usually don't. But your third eye is open. Again, pay attention to your intuitions. Some of you guys are readers out there, intuitive, learning about tarot. But, but again, spirituality, ascending, awakening to your truth. Your eyes are opening to your truth. I know that everything in my life manifests from within. Exactly. So you're going within right now and releasing, healing. Okay? So you have to forgive. You have to release in order to grow. Right? And remain optimistic. Okay, where whatever whatever standpoint you at in life at this time, it's because you chose to be there. Remember that. You can make anything happen, but everybody goes through their karma. Everybody goes through bad, uh, bad times. Okay, but it's the choices that you make that'll make you and break you in life. Okay. But again, some of you guys, the black magic is it's like going against your free will. That's just somebody fucking around there with your free will. So keep pushing through. That's it. You got to keep pushing through. Perseverance. Got a piece of paper here. Keep your mind positive, guys. Although you're going through some shit, trust me. <laughs> Been there, done that. And follow your intuitions. 10, 10. Closing out of cycles, a new cycle beginning. Again, you may be seeing mirrored numbers. 19, 19, 91, 91. Okay? Trust in your intuition. Yep. Follow your intuitions. And the universe. Trust. Believe. You're divinely guided along your path towards your true life purpose. Again, you're awakening. You're going through an awakening process. It's not easy. It's difficult. But yes. Okay. But always follow your intuition and trust in the process. That this is all aligning with your life purpose. And you're evolving into a better version of yourself. Okay. 
no matter what's going what, what you're going through but in order for us to grow we have to release negative patterns and toxic people and environments okay you know I was <laughs> my grandfather funeral is Friday and um, it's gonna be in Miami and when they asked me if was I going I said no straight up why because pretty care for my family that's number one and number two I'm gonna be around 200 and something people because my family is big people that I haven't spoken to in years the first thing that they was telling me my aunts some of my aunts and stuff, I don't have a lot of family I don't know how you're doing and what you've been up to that's how I like it I don't know what the, I don't I don't want you to know what the fuck I'm doing and what what do you care now yeah <laughs> you ain't care before fuck out of here yeah intentions set your intentions okay yeah, so mark a calendar, start writing down your your ideas, okay? So every day is a new day, guys. Stay away from drugs and alcohol and any reckless behavior at this time because, again, you're spiritually ascending. So reckless sex, smoking, and drinking, toxic people, stay away from the fucking bullshit, okay? Yes. Today is a fresh start. No matter how my day was yesterday, in the past, I can make of today whatever I want. My intention for today is, and write down your intentions. Write a list. Okay? Yeah. I don't like that many people any fucking way. The first thing they're going to do when I get to the fucking funeral is like, Oh, look at Tasha. Where's she been? Blah, 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 blah. No. I'm good. You don't need to know shit about me. X, yes, you give yourself a fresh start, okay? But with the X here, I do see some type of pregnancy for some of you guys, fertility, okay? Yes, but things picking up in your life, like I said, just keep pushing through. Don't worry about it. But uh, again, every day is a new day to start over. That's the key, right? So fuck what happened yesterday. Fuck what people were doing on you. Remain positive because they want to see you fucked up. Don't give them, don't give them the best of you. That's it. Okay, some of you guys may have raised chickens or have a chicken farm or love chickens or eggs. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> My family think I'm a bitch and I don't really give a fuck. So you see this shit? Black magic and all this shit, you going, I've been there, done that. Trust me. Yeah, what I said, perseverance. Been there, done that. The key to it is perseverance, okay? You may feel like you are getting nowhere, but there are wonderful changes ahead. Don't give up. Boom, bada, bing. Everything I was saying, you know? Give yourself a fresh start, but you have to cut away toxic people and toxic situations out of your fucking life. That's it. Family, friend, fake friends. That's it. It is what it is. I mean, why would you want to keep people around that's not assisting or helping you grow? You know? Basically. I just, you know, maintain your peace. Right now I'm at peace. I don't want to talk to no fucking body. Okay? You know, some of you guys, you work better by yourself. The hit. Yep, word up. Yeah, cut your cords. What every fucking thing I was just saying. Cut your cords with these fucking people, toxic people that's not helping you improve your fucking life. Or whatever rendezvous you're doing. Okay? Yes. A soulmate is definitely coming in or you're connecting with a soulmate. And honor how far you have come. But it's all about your spiritual progress and transformation with the butterfly wings. Okay? Yes. Love your challenges. Love your challenges. Yes. Life is all of, life is all about tests and challenges. You're always going to be challenged. Okay? But, again, you need to cut those cords. All right? And your spirit guides are protecting you at this time.
Yeah, past life experience. Again, you choose your life. So you're wrapping up karmic debt in this past life. It's all about self-love at this time. Loving yourself, healing yourself. Okay, not fighting the process. Yeah, I know how far you have come. Yeah. The butterfly, transformation. And you be being of service, learning, you see? Spiritually growing and learning about your spirituality. Okay? Learning and growing. Awakening. Feel confused. Is it this? No, no, no. I'm gonna check your energy again. got fucking pissed with me, but I don't care. I don't give a fuck. So somebody <laughs> must be pissed with you, because right now you don't give a fuck. Okay, you cutting the cords, you doing what's necessary for you. You're evolving. Okay, hold your vision, fix moves. So you guys are a fixed sign. So you guys may be dealing with an Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio. Or you may have that one of those signs as your moon. So you may be a double Taurus or Aquarius, Scorpio, or Leo as a moon. Okay, but hold your vision. Okay, honor how far you have come. The obstacles. Love your challenges, basically. Okay, yes, it's not easy, but it's rewarding at the end. All right. Yeah, abundance is near. Yep, and change. You're going in a new direction. Okay, guys? Yes, the gateway is opening. Some of you guys may be born in the year of the horse, but definitely go. And again, when I see this carousel, things are up in the air with you, but you're moving in silence. Okay, moving towards your happiness. Like I said, you know, when I see this card, it's moving towards your happiness. Okay, but moving in silence. But when I see this card, it's like childhood, childhood wounding, childhood healing, things from the past that that you need to heal that you're still healing okay but definitely abundance is on the horizon and you know building the courage to do what you need to do no matter how rough the seas may be because your emotions are like all over the place you see forgiveness yeah releasing and forgiving yes forgiveness is the hardest okay yeah you're healing through this chaos though whatever you're going through you're healing and you're transforming okay Definitely abundance and wealth, health, things are blooming. But as 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 soon as you cut those cords and change course and forgive and release, you're gonna see how things pick up for you. Okay, but just stay focused. <laughs> That's all. Just gonna check your energy really quick before because I want to pull tarot on you guys. Yeah, you see, never ending story in reverse. Never ending story in reverse, which means that you're gaining a new perspective and you're changing the story. You're changing the chapter. You're finishing up, you're wrapping up a book, and now you're changing the book. Book learning. Okay? Ascending. Yes, ascending into the, a better version of yourself, awakening to your truth. Be authentic, not lying and, and, and running away from what is happening to you. Okay? And I do see with the heart, so you guys feel like, you see, with the mirror, it wasn't facing the truth. Not looking in the mirror, not facing the truth. Okay? With the heart, it's like, some of you guys feel like your heart is at, your love life is at a standstill. You're confused about how you feel, okay, about your life purpose or what's happening to you or this step. 
No, now you're gaining a new perspective and you're coming out of this funk, okay? Being optimistic. 37 is 10. Closing out a cycle and you're entering into a new phase. And I do see love coming in, okay? De developing new friendships and opening your heart to, you know, new ideas and love and change, up for change, right? Yes, new life. A new life. Releasing and being happy. Yep, these are the cards I see. So new life and being happy with your new life and being happy. I see star status. Okay, so you guys are star seeds, celebrity status. Stars is Aquarius. You may be dealing with an Aquarius. Some of you guys may be gymnasts or child actors out there. Okay, yes. Or your children may be actors or getting your children into some type of acting. But 26 is 8, the infinite sign, infinite possibilities. Okay, 39 is 12. 12 is Trinity. Loving yourself, knowing yourself, self-love, self-care, and releasing and and not a care in the world. Okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Your third eye is protected with the star here. Yeah, missing piece. You feel like there's a missing piece. You're still trying to figure it out. Okay, some of you guys are at a breaking point. Okay, Halloween. People wearing masks around you, like I said, cutting these cords. Some of you guys may be dealing with a Scorpio. Something significant about that holiday as well. Yeah, projection. Okay, so be careful with people trying to project their energy on you. Catfish. Be careful with meeting up with people that are not really being fully honest about who they are. Yeah, but there's going to be a reason to celebrate. I do see promotion, new job, apartment, engagement, married. Some of you guys are married already. Yeah, a new line of study. You see, you're learning. You're learning. The book, Little Book of Spells. But you're learning about spirituality. You're developing at this time okay trusting in the process not being stubborn not trying to fight it but there's somebody who wants to compromise here fork in the road okay some of you guys are still indecisive of which direction you want to go in but you need to make a decision here but gain a lot of clarity in your life and what this is your life and where you at right now because you guys are at a breaking point Yeah, you're going through a transformation. But cleanse your space. Cleanse your space, guys. Yeah, you're leaving it behind. Go in a new direction. Pay attention to the signs and symbols at this time. Somebody's definitely getting tower readings on you, okay? Hidden truths. They're trying to find out about your life at this time. But they're under judgment, okay? With the judgment card, yeah, you're seeing through the fog. They wanted to leave you in a fog, but you're seeing through the fog. You're seeing things clearly now. Your, eye, your third eye is open. Your intuitions. Follow your intuitions. Yeah, wrong way. They want to leave you confused, stuck in a row. Yeah, helpful people. The help is on the way. So if you guys are in need of help or, you know, God is going to send, the universe is going to send the right people to assist you. When I see hidden truth is somebody, yeah, abundance. There you go, bam. That's all I need to see. So if you guys were concerned about money or I, it's coming. Yeah, but somebody wants to compromise here, a peaceful resolution. But you guys are gonna you guys are gonna be 
you know, I'm doing big things. I mean, what can I say? One this came out twice, okay? So they're trying to confuse you, though, from going in your life path or, you know, your life purpose, doing what you love, following your heart. Yeah, your life purpose, okay? But, again, it's, it's you need to release. You need to release. Yeah, and cleanse, okay, and cleanse your space. Somebody wants to apologize here. Yeah, they want to leave you confused, but you're not confused. Again, pay attention to the signs and symbols. Spirit is protecting you guys at this time, but there's somebody obsessively stuck on you, somebody from your past that you're leaving behind. This may have been a third-party situation, but again, childhood healing. So something that you are reflecting on in the past that happened to you as a child, that's for some of you guys that it's time to leave it behind. Okay, but again, there's an obsessive energy here. Cuffing season, you may be meeting somebody around winter time. Okay, but things are about to get heated for you. But again, send an evil eyes. Possibly New Year's. You've been, you're gonna be meeting with someone. Okay. <laughs> so let's see what's this missing piece. Okay, because there's hidden truths here and. Let's just see what this bullshit is about. Yeah, Eight of Pentacles. Okay, this may be something having to do with work or at work. Okay, or working on something or things not working out. But let's see. Let's work, work. The Emperor Empress. There may be something having to do with a boss at work. But I do see a higher position coming in towards you guys. Something that you've been working very hard for that's coming in. But there is somebody here on top. Again, this may be a same-sex relationship. Some of you guys may be sleeping and fucking around at work with somebody. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. And a pregnancy is involved here. I'm just saying. Okay? But <laughs> I was just saying. I was just saying. This is a little scandalous fucking shit going on here. All right, <laughs> but what is the missing piece that that yeah some of you guys may be married, but it's definitely emperor empress. You're really, you know, taking care of yourself. Yeah, sex at work. Some of you guys may be having sex with the boss. I'm just saying, <laughs> yo, go Taurus. I mean, it is what it is. It is what it is. It is what it is. Okay, but there's a missing piece. So. Possibly, yeah, yeah, yeah. See, because, oh, okay. Well, some of you guys may be holding back from sex. Possibly something happened while you was at work, occurred at work, okay, while you was working. Because it's like you guys are trying to figure something. Oh, okay. Ooh, okay. Some of you guys are trying to figure something out concerning a pregnancy. <laughs> like something that adding up here. I'm just saying, <laughs> this is getting interesting now. I'm just fucking saying. <laughs> so, because it's like, somebody here is pregnant. I'm just saying, <laughs> somebody here, there's a pregnancy, okay? But you guys are trying to figure out how did this occur? Because I don't see you, you guys having sex. Some of you guys are holding back from sex, okay? All right. That's for some of you guys, but I do see you traveling because there was some type of deception that happened here, some type of trickery, somebody trying to mind fuck you, okay, concerning a child and payment for a child or paying for a child, okay? This may have been friends, but well, some of you guys, if you're fucking around at work, this may be friends with benefits. Be careful with getting somebody pregnant at work. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, okay? But I do see you <laughs> I do see you taking action in your life. Okay, but this is missing piece. This is missing piece. Okay, yeah, so there's research going on. Okay, but I do see somebody sexually active here. Yeah, yep, yep. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so this is, uh, again, for some of you guys, this is having to do with a pregnancy, a child, or a child in question. Okay, and you holding back. I don't see you having sex with this person, 
okay so how you know so you're trying to figure something out here concerning a person and a child and doing the the math okay like continuation from the last reading <laughs> I'm just saying, some of you guys are fucking the boss. I mean, hey, yo, Taurus, get your shit on. <laughs> it is what it is, all right? Just be careful not to get anybody pregnant at work. Okay? All right. Let me pull some tarot for you. Let me pull some tarot. Yeah, but there's a lot of sex. A fresh, fresh start. Eggs. There's a lot of sex. You're going to be a lot of that. But new beginnings for you and new projects. Embarking on new ideas and new projects. Okay? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. I heard some of you guys are trying to get out of a contract. Yeah, four cups in reverse. You're choosing happiness. Okay, you're getting a lot of clarity about your life. Some of you guys were feeling depressed, but you're becoming aware of things now. Okay, there's a missed opportunity and love coming back around for you guys as well. Okay. Yeah, you may meet somebody at a gas. A lot of cups here. A lot of cups. Okay, four and three of cups is a seven of cups. So you're weighing out your options at this time, which a lot of wishful thinking, a lot of daydreaming going on here as well. A lot of nostalgia, but I do see some type of gathering taking place here. Okay, some type of gathering. You may, you know, be meeting someone um, at a work party or, you know, out with friends. Okay, but socializing more. Okay, but again, protect your energy. Protect your energy but there is definitely a joyful a celebration coming up okay yes with friends but yeah this may have been for some of you guys a third party situation with the three of cups i'm just saying all right but you're choosing happiness and i do see celebration in terms of promotion apartment house yeah okay a baby for some of you guys but again with the seven of cups a lot of deep thinking going on with you and clearing, 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 healing, releasing. <sighs> Again, some of you guys may be drinking a lot. Careful with that shit. Yeah, ten of wands in reverse. You're releasing burdens at this time. There were a few delays, but you know you're releasing your you're you're relieving yourself from stress. Page of Wands in reverse. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Be careful with impulsive actions, but there's some type of conflict. There's some type of bad news coming. Okay. And it could be in terms of money, but I do see some type of investigation when it comes to money or a house or a family situation. Mm -hmm. Interrogation. Interrogation. Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Be careful with uh, gambling. Yeah, you're very guarded at this time. Be careful with gambling. Okay. Yes. But careful with risky investments pertaining to money. Okay. Yes. But there's a little bit of obsessiveness going on here. Yeah, the magician. Somebody's trying to mind fuck you here. Here goes this magic here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You may have a, a, a bitch on top of you. Um, King, Queen of Swords. But there's a bitch on top of you. Okay. Secretly watching you. Talk a shit. Alright, but again, it's something about business. Yeah, secretly watching you. Your social media, your platform. Okay. But there's a, something that you're trying to get out of. There's an investment that you're trying to get out of at this time. That's for some of you guys that you felt like somebody deceived you here. Okay? And you're trying to release this burden. 
but it's with the bad news here is somebody here that's trying to hold you up to a contract that's for some of you guys yeah but new beginnings for you with the fool card okay because i do see you guys moving any fucking way but some of you guys felt like you made a foolish decision getting in getting in some type of business or investment with somebody here because i feel like it's a king uh, it's a it's a duo okay it's like this person is telling you oh you didn't read the fine print here you know again i said some of you guys may be into the porn business as well i'm just saying <laughs> okay i'm just saying like but i do see you giving yourself new beginnings and moving away from this bullshit all right, but with the fool card here, this is Aquarius Aries. There's somebody here that made a foolish, it's a, it was a bad move, a bad move. You didn't follow your intuitions, but before it happens, follow your fucking intuitions. Yeah, tower, shit is gonna hit the fan here. Okay, this queen of swords keeps shit, okay. Yes, this is having to do with money, okay, and legal matters here something that is old to you or to them but whatever it is somebody's suing you over property money okay but some of you guys may have a female lawyer and going to court as as we speak okay yes but i do see a joyous occasion around this but you're speaking your truth and you're being totally honest with yourself but i do see a big payout coming something that's been taking a while Okay? Yes. And I do see you guys being single and independent, but you guys are really up in your head about this decision when it comes to your finances and the outcome. Okay. The tower is Scorpio, uh, Scorpio Sagittarius. Queen of Swords is Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. Justice is Libra. The Magician is Gemini. Okay, but I do see you guys being single, independent. Single on top of your game again when this payout comes, but I do see promotion as well. Okay, this may have been due to a job as well that you're, you know, suing your job. But with the Knight of Cups, you're following your heart. But there's there's a there's a decision that you're gonna, that's gonna be made here. Revlon. Some of you guys may be makeup artists out there. Okay, love Revlon. Okay, or getting into some type of cosmetology or doing yourself up again. But there's some t decision that's gonna be made here that you're gonna be satisfied with. Okay, but I do see a proposal coming in, and I do see. Again, a generous offer, giving and receiving, a helpful hand coming in. But again, careful, careful to read the fine print and don't don't look at the money and say, oh, okay, because risky investments, things come at tower moments happening over money, over money, okay? Yes, this may be a chop, this may be, this may be for a child as well, but I do see brighter days ahead. That's the truth. A breakthrough for you. New beginnings. Okay. Definitely a lot of spying going on here. A lot of sexual energy. A lot of masturbation here. Okay. But again, truths surrounding possibly a child. Okay. A job situation. But you're gaining clarity about your life. All right. But I do see a decision that's going to break through. Something coming that's going to, that's going to, that's going to leave you in a great headspace and heart space. Okay. Yeah, the moon. This is something that you can't see. Yeah, this is concerning a lot of money, possibly property, like I said. Um, a business that you got into with somebody that it was you want out of. But I do see a big payout. Yeah, it's just a waiting game for this payout. But this is going to put you back on top of your game. King, queen of pentacles. Again, some of you guys are married out there and going through legal issues with your own family, contracts, will. Yes. Okay. But again, this is having to do with work, business, money, contracts. Yeah, there's something on the judgment here. Okay. 
that you're waiting for. It's just a lot of eyes on you as well. There's a lot of eyes on you. Some of you guys may be in your feelings at this time. Yeah. But there's a secret surrounding this business and family situation that you couldn't see. Like it was unexpected drama, unforeseen problems here. Yeah, but things are coming to an end. So you guys may be careful that you, you know, that you don't get locked up for this. Hold on, guys. Shit. Yeah. With the death. Okay. Things coming to an end. All right. Some of you guys are stuck in your head, stuck in a situation. You may be having dark thoughts about your life. If you understand what I mean, don't do anything. Stay prayed up. Okay. Don't do anything silly. All right. Because you're really up in your mind and you feel stuck in the situation. Yeah. Waiting for a decision to come through. But it's like a battle. It's, 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 it's a battle right now. A power struggle. Okay. I just like somebody on top of you here. Like you, you know, you know what you agreed to. Blah, blah, blah. Ah, ah, ah. Yes. But these people. Mm -hmm. But again, be careful with getting arrested. Some of you guys are already in jail or dealing with somebody in jail. Okay. Mm -hmm. And again, something about a child. Be careful with children. But again. But again, but again, <laughs> waiting for a decision to be made. Here, waiting, waiting. Yeah, but again, it's going to put you on top. There's an emperor, empress coming in. Yeah, things working out for you. Okay, there's somebody keeping their eye on you. Emperor, empress, possibly a mother figure or older person, but somebody of high status. Okay. Yeah, but things are going to be working out for you in the end, okay? So, you know, it's maybe a little bit of delays, but don't worry about that, Taurus. What time is it? Okay, I got to go. I've got a lot of readings to do. Yeah, persistence. Stay the course. Don't give up. Okay? Yes, you know there a, there's something in the, the bird house, right? You know there's a bird thing, right? So, persistence. Perseverance. Don't give up. Okay? That's the key. You know your breakthrough is coming. So, remain optimistic, guys. Abundance is, is right there. Yeah, but you see, territorial. Find your own place. You may be dealing with an Aquarius as well because Aquarius got this card. But it's like all people all over your shit on top of you, okay? And you're trying to break free. You're trying to cut those cords. So it's time to cut those cords, okay? Again, some of you guys may live in an overcrowded place or trying to find your own place. But you're going to get it, okay? Entitlement. Check your prima donna. Okay, yeah. Aquarius got these two cards, okay? So, yeah. You're putting yourself on the pedestal at this time, okay? Emperor, empress status, okay? And you're all about business and taking risks with the cards here. But again, risky investments. Careful. Careful not to get into any binding contracts that could fuck you over. Yeah, action. Seize the day. So every day is a new day to start over, right, guys? And show gratitude for the, for the things that you do have, which is life, to continue to keep going, right? Smell the fresh roses. Wake up and smell the... Fresh fucking roses. <laughs> yeah, you see? You're awakening to your truth. Eyes wide open. But you're, you're still keeping an eye on things. Spirit wants you to still keep an eye on things. And investigate. Okay? I, I keep seeing action. Okay? So, seize the day. Hold on. Sorry about that. I'm trying to control the noise here. 
you know, I'm in New York, where I live is, <laughs> it's nice, but a lot of noise. Yeah, empathy, I see and hear you. So there's somebody trying to use emotional manipulation here, okay, vulnerable. Somebody wants you to, somebody wants to be vulnerable with you, somebody that was hiding their feelings for you, they want to open up to you now, but Spirit wants you to, to open up and be receptive to your feelings as well, okay, the strength to show yourself. All right, but empathy. It's like I see and hear you, but I don't see and hear you at the same time. Okay, just taking the lead in your life. Some of you guys may love to play, play frisbee with your dog. Okay, but persistence, perseverance. Okay, <laughs> yes. A lot of shit here energy healer okay so again you're healing you're healing you're in solitude healing limiting beliefs it came out fumble why because your belief is starting to change your belief system is starting to change you're gaining a new perspective okay the situation calls for reprogram your belief system exactly so you're reprogramming you're awakening at this time so it's like you know yeah you're a natural born leader <laughs> there you go you take the lead of your life okay check your prima donna 11 all right, you were born to lead others. It is a it is a part of your life's path, of course. Tauruses are leaders, and hibernation. You're in solitude right now, growing spiritually, growing and developing. Okay, learning, learning, right? Reading books, looking up, researching. Your soul needs time alone for meditation and rest. Staying connected to the divine. Yes, staying prayed up. Okay, figuring out life and what is happening to you. Okay, and bullshit, you know. And if you didn't believe in black magic and whatever, oh, you're researching that shit too, right? <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I do see that you guys are focused on money and work. Okay, working on yourself. All right, but there is somebody else, somebody coming in, but. Yeah, focused on you and your, your work. Your, your, you know, some of you guys are parents out there, fathers, mothers. Yeah, some of you guys may be dealing with an Aries or a Scorpio, but there is a fiery passion coming in. It's like motivated. Again, perseverance. I do see you getting, receiving honors for something as well. Graduating with honors. Traveling. Going in a new direction. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, King, Queen of Cups. So you guys may be dealing with a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or may have water predominantly in your chart, all right? But again, you're releasing, emotionally maturing, right? Yes, but there's somebody supportive that's coming in. Some of you guys are seek psychics, healers out there, healers, but healing oneself, again, healing oneself, all right? There's somebody loyal, dedicated, yeah, what I said, your third eye is opening. It's opened, okay, yes. Gaining higher wisdom. Seat of intuition. Clarity. Using discernment. Yeah, you may be dealing with a Capricorn, but Capricorn is all about hard work, dedication, taking the lead, discipline, responsibility, self-control. Okay? King, queen of earth. This may be a same sex. Again, same sex relationship. Hold on, guys. Yeah. Okay? But you're all about business at this time. Business, your, finan your finances, you're being rational. Mm -hmm. Black magic in reverse. <laughs> okay, yeah. It's going to be a turnaround in your situation. Yeah, you guys are looking very handsome and sexy and attractive. Attracting a lot of eyes. Yeah, but Akashic Records, whoa. Yeah, there's going to be a turnaround in your situation. You're going to be getting it together. Some of you guys were living in a home in a shelter, okay? But I do see better choices. You're making better choices. You're going to get a new job. You're, you're just feeling motivated at this time to do better, 
okay yeah akashic records you have the ability to see the past present and future some of you guys may have had a side piece i don't see it anymore okay yeah there's somebody keeping an eye on you here okay but again an eye on you and your money may be an aquarius okay but that was a side piece <laughs> just saying <laughs> okay but yeah lots of money coming in guys okay solid offers but again careful with investments and too good to be true okay so let's see let's see who the fuck is this watching find all your social media your pictures online drive by this person is obsessed <laughs> okay abundance baby yeah death okay this may be a scorpio but whatever it is between you and this person it's over okay or it's coming to an end yeah nine of pentacles because i do see somebody single here you single or they're single whatever but yeah you guys about your business but whoever this is this is somebody that is um it's single it's 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 have their shit together <sighs> yeah seven of pentacles okay there's a distance between you and this person this person still still feels emotionally attached to you there are hidden feelings here again this may be a same-sex relationship for some of you guys okay somebody that you walked away from or they walked away from you they had too many options here but you had to weigh out your options okay when it come, came to you and this person Yeah, justice. There's a decision that's taking a long time here. Justice is Libra. But somebody's keeping an eye on whatever court case or whatever case that is going through going going down here. Somebody may have passed away here and you know there's a payout that you guys are waiting for. Yeah, two of pentacles. There's a decision that's up in the air here. Okay? But whoever this is, it's like a lot of people, it's a power struggle here. It's a power struggle. Okay? When it comes to finances. Mm -hmm. There's somebody running, and, running away and avoiding a uh, serious conversation here. But I do see you guys, you know, looking for your 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 you're standing your ground when it comes to your belief, what you believe in. Okay, you're standing your ground and you're looking at the prize, which is new beginnings for you. But with the five of swords, it's like nobody, it's like pointing fingers, but everybody wanna win at all costs here. Uh-huh. I do see you holding back payment though. Either them was holding back payment, either this was due to child support, you waiting for some type of child support that somebody wasn't paying up, a decision being made that's up in the air, or about a child, but with the page of pentacles in reverse, there's something like holding back, not investing, okay, and closing out cycles, the world, focus on you, but they're watching your whole shit right now, they're all over your shit, a queen of swords, yeah, I can't make this up okay yes but there's some type of investigation going on this person is very investigative okay especially when it comes to finances and what's happening with money okay the money the money situation here okay somebody's asking a lot of fucking questions here and all over your shit doing some type of investigation here just saying yes i don't see that about love okay I see that about watching your money. What you're doing with your money, spending, blah, 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 blah. That's crazy shit. Follow your intuitions, guys. 
Yeah, but you're taking the lead of your life. And you're remaining isolated. Don't post anything, guys. Let me get some love messages here. Let me lighten up this fucking read a little bit. Because, because this is all about money. <laughs> it's all about money, man. I would never forget you. Oh, somebody would never forget about you guys. Okay. They're sending you healing energy. This is possibly a twin flame, a soulmate here. That's trying to connect with you on the 5D. Yeah, nightmares. Somebody's up in their head. They're trying to... There's a lot of gossip surrounding you at this time. Around this situation here. Yeah, what I said. Somebody's masturbating to you. Somebody's pleasing themselves all night long. <laughs> or you may be. Okay, somebody wants to start over here. Celebration. Mm -mm. In reverse. Somebody's not going to be happy about some type of outcome. Because I do see... Yeah, you're not settling for less anymore. You're not settling for shit. Yeah, if you love me, just say it. I don't see you saying you love anybody. Yeah, let's have a baby in reverse. This is possibly having to do with a child uh, in question, a baby. But somebody possibly wanted to get you pregnant or you get get them pregnant. Okay, did it work out? But there's a, something about a baby involved here that's more than likely you're going to be, yeah, there's a new love coming in. Ah! Okay, yeah, but kicked out an eviction. Something about, yeah, a place, a place to stay. Somebody's depressed, crying over you. Ah, yeah, you're moving on, though. You're moving on. You're moving on. Somebody wants to make love to you here. <laughs> yeah, but some of you guys are going through court legal issues at this time. They're obsessed with you. Okay, but definitely a new love is coming in, guys. Definitely. Let's see who's this new love before, yeah, before I close out your reading. Because I'm going to close out your reading, guys. I'm going to close out your reading. I'm going to close out your reading. So this new love may be a Capricorn. Okay. A earth sign like yourself. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Or a water sign. Uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Yeah, the tower. This is going to take you by surprise. This person that's coming in. <laughs> okay. You may meet through court. Let me stop. Yeah, two of pentacles in reverse. Okay, letting down your guards. Letting down your guards with someone. Somebody feel like they dropped the ball on you too, but with the world, this is a new cycle that you're entering in. Okay, you may meet this person online. I'm just saying that's for some of you guys. Okay, yeah, there's going to be fighting for your attention here. The world is Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio. But you're stepping out as a new person. Like, really feel yourself, guys. <laughs> but some of you guys are just, yeah, five of pentacles. Okay. Mm -mm. <sighs> right now, you're ghosting people. <laughs> you're ghosting people, okay? But somebody feel abandoned here, all right? But, yeah, check your health. Again, there may be concerns about property, all right? But I do see you leaving somebody out in the dust, okay? Yes, temperance, okay? But it's all a waiting game. It's all a waiting game. And you're getting spiritual enlightenment at this time, okay? Trying to release burdens. Who is this person? Sagittarius? Yeah, this is somebody that's single that's going to be reaching out to you. This is somebody that's single and got their shit together, okay? Mm-hmm. Divinely guided towards you. Yeah, Seven of Swords. Uh -uh. Yeah, there may be some lies and deceptiveness going on in the family situation here. Nine, uh, Seven of Cups. This person, you're going to have to weigh out your options with this person. Okay? You are. This is definitely a crush that's coming in. A secret crush. But it can lead to the Ten of Cups here. You know, you don't see this yet because there's a lot of bullshit that's surrounding a situation here with lies and deceit, and you're you having to heal oneself before this new love comes in. Okay.
Yeah, something is going to be happening lightning fast. Okay, quick changes. Love striking you unexpectedly. Shocking events. <laughs> Told you, tower. But you're going to have to heal first. Okay? Yeah. Some of you guys may be receiving sad news around a death or a situation that occurred. Very disappointed. But I do see celebration. And you taking time off. But again, like I said, you're up in the air about things. Okay, yeah. There's a waiting game for an outcome. A final decision. Okay? Yes, dreams. But pay attention to your dreams, your visions. Yeah, there's chaos. Possibly surrounding a child. All right? Yeah, sadness. Yeah, but you guys are cold-hearted at this time. You feel cold. You feel... So when this... this You just feel closed off at this time. You focus on your money. You focus on your money. Gifts, okay? Yes, it's taking a long time, but it is definitely coming. Okay? And property, okay? Gifts, uh, money, and property. That's what you focused on right now. Yes, but see, unexpected. Some of you guys, it was an unexpected drama that occurred here. An unexpected death for some of you guys. Okay, you're really in your head, but somebody wants to leave you in your head confused. But don't worry. Prepare. Yeah, rescue, but help is on the way, like I said. And comfort being restored back in your life. But caution when it comes to people. Okay, be careful with fires. Okay, some of you guys may be fire, work, work for the fire department or be dating someone, meeting someone. Okay, gonna end this. Yeah, isolation. You feeling lonely at this time? In solitude? <sighs> yeah, self care, balance. Balance being restored in your life. Releasing, meditation, healing. Okay, yes. Some of you guys may be into yoga or Pilates, but really connecting to the divine learning taking time to replenish your mind body and soul is a must enjoy this time to reconnect and make make yourself a priority ask yourself what is serving me and what is taken away from me what is taken away from you cutting those cords much can be revealed when you stop putting yourself at the bottom of the list facts 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 and be honest with yourself okay you think i give a fuck you know, when I told my aunts and shit that I wasn't going to the funeral, my family, I didn't give a fuck. Why? Because they don't serve me well. That's why. I'm going to be around people. Tower. You're going to be climbing to the top. Okay? Earning power. Bam. Building a business. Boom. Sound decision. Career. Cor corporate job power and unstable position so unstable position risky investments careful okay but that is your reading i mean yo go to a risk i mean i ain't even mad at you you doing your thing right now stay positive you're awakening to your truth okay it's not an easy journey but fresh starts fresh beginnings perseverance okay and self-care all right but i love you guys i'm possible you're possible your girl tosh i'm out